Well, right now, a move is underway to save the Jazz Museum. The Kansas City City Council is voting on a resolution that allows the museum to continue operating. A scathing report by consultants was critical of the museum, saying it lacked vision and identity despite being open for 20 years. Yesterday, the director of the museum stepped down. Kelly Taylor is live at City Hall as the council considers what should happen next. Kelly? Well, Brad, the council just took one of many steps to rebuild the American Jazz Museum, and one councilman says it's a move in the right direction. The city council unanimously approved a resolution that directs the city manager to change the American Jazz Museum's 2017-2018 fiscal year contract to show $730,000 of city funds. The contract renewal for the museum's budget for this year will also be delayed until a new board is named and they'll have until May 15th. The city auditor will monitor new leadership to make sure they are following the 26 recommendations identified in a consultant report. The museum over the past 20 years has not necessarily had uh, a revisioning session and so this allows for us to move forward with strategic planning but then also allows for us to move in a new direction. As long as the community can keep the heritage of what Kinson, Missouri is about, that's what's most important because outside of barbecue, every time you hear about Kansas City, you hear about music and jazz. And the city manager will also name an, an interim executive director for the museum, and they'll have to report back to the Finance and Government Committee by May 16th with the progress of what's going on over at the museum. Live in Kansas City, Kelly Taylor, KCTV 5 News.